Hello everyone, you're welcome. I'm going to show you how to add a new screen that you have personally designed. Go to allstreamhub.com slash dashboard. I'm hoping that you have already signed in. If not, it will take you to the sign in page and prompt you to sign in. Okay, so uh, here I am on the screens. You got the screens tab, add screen. And now the screen dialog will come. Put a screen name for this. We shall call it simple screen. You also need the width and the height of the screen depending on uh, what you're going to stream. So, for example, I stream at 1280 by 720. It's in pixels. Save the changes. Now there are some buttons here. There is the first one is copy the link to the screen. The second one is edit the screen. The next is delete. So I click on edit the screen. It takes me to a window to edit the screen. Now in this window, there are a few components on the right. I am going to start with the scripture or lyrics. So once I drag that into the editing window, this is how your scripture lyrics will look like. Yeah, just uh, double click in there so that I can type scripture just so that I don't get confused. Yeah, so when you click on it and move back to the right, there is a settings tab at the top. Now, now this, this is where most of the assignment works. Show on start now. There are many things there. I'll explain them in another video. But these are the main ones at the bottom. On scripture, show. Remember, this is for scripture. So once we send scripture, it will show. You need to change the special role scripture only. On lyrics, hide. On others, hide. So when we send lyrics, it will be hidden. When we send other things, it will be hidden. When we send scriptures, it will be shown. Yeah, so you can ignore the rest. Now, let's, those are the, these are the layers that we have. I will just hide it right now so that I can put another layer in the same position. Then I'll put uh, the same thing, but this one is for lyrics. So I'll just double click that and put lyrics so that I don't get uh, confused in any way. And uh, yeah, so once I click on it, I go back to the settings and add on scripture, hide, on lyrics, show, and on others, hide. Special role, lyrics only. Yeah, those are the major settings for now. I'll show the rest in another video. Yeah, this is uh, where you can change the way it looks, but we shall not do that for now. Just to show you. There's a lot. Once you've clicked on an item, the editable parts are here. You can really change to whatever you want. So let's go back and add the text. Yeah, we'll drag that in. So this will be the main speaker. Name. Let's just move it to a good location. Now we go to its settings while it is still selected. We give it a dashboard label so that in the dashboard we can know exactly what we are changing without getting confused. And so we'll go and make it editable. Of course, it has to be editable. We won't show it and start, so we shall not click that. Animation, we've chosen slide. Special role. Uh, not needed so much on scripture hide on lyrics hide on others show yeah so those are the main things you need for it let's go back and add another text layer they look alike so i'll just drag it out to the side so that they don't uh, i don't get confused and exactly what i'm editing now i come to general I need to change how it looks because we can't use the same thing. So got decorations, background color, click on it. It's a very self-explanatory editor. 
unless you've never had a background in editing anything but if you've used any other tool you can manage to use this one yeah we've set a background color there are many other things that we can set here there's typography yeah there's layout a few things and so i'll go and change the padding just to make it a little bit tidy padding right padding left as you can see when i come back haven't i been to this decorations tab i think so yeah so there's border right radius border left radius just to make it look kind of nice like as you can see uh, those are things you can play with in other words this tool you can make with this tool you can make anything that you want and make it exactly look like what you want it to look like so we'll just change the font style a bit we don't want to use the same font style as the main using font family there are very many in there double click on that and change it to details so we don't get confused so we need to go and uh, change its settings let's prepare it for work now dashboard label details so we know what we're editing i'll tell you what the control id does later editable animation we've chosen elemental lower third yes special role not needed on scripture hide on lyrics hide on others show yeah so, so it can come so that once lyrics are sent it leaves but you could leave it there if you want choice is yours we shall go back to the layers and find it yeah then we'll drag it down so that's exactly how i want that you can be above this one just polish up a few other things so i'm going to hide this one of lyrics first so that i can i want to put some other item at that same position though they won't show together we'll show a different time it's called a slider so once i drag it in there its size is a bit small but let's edit it right now yes we shall go to typography and then font size just choose the desired size that you want yeah let me edit it a bit because i want this one to show from the beginning without having to activate it on the dashboard okay i can now go to the main part the settings dashboard label i will call it slider uh, layer name we don't need that for now editable yes it's editable show on set yes we want to show it on start animation we shall choose one special role not really on scripture hide On scripture hide on lyrics hide on others show yeah so that's it we're done with editing that screen we can now go to obs and have a look at it yeah, so we come back to the screens here let's refresh a bit just so we can have the latest changes got the screens tab and uh, the link is there click on that button to copy the link to the clipboard we come back to details and uh, the default screen with its main with its uh, is already there but uh, we can ignore that for now but this is a custom screen now the custom screen will be at the bottom once you hide the first one you can see the screen you want to edit 
and uh, here we are go to obs add a browser source and put the url that you copied in there it's a unique url but you can give it to anyone whom you want to see what you're doing with 1280 and the height 720 as we had set when creating the screen okay just uh, make it adjust it to fit the screen and so let's come to the dashboard itself and from here we shall do yeah just resize it so that i can see both screens on the same screen so the main info i'll put details abraham okello details ceo yeah slider let me change those ones too so i send the slider it has changed you might not see but it has changed send main info and i send details they come using the animation that we selected so i come back to the scripture tab choose the book i want chapter i want click on it it comes you see the ones get hidden and the scripture comes there are a few more scriptures there are there are also other versions that are major versions are included here so you can send the scripture in whatever version you wish lyrics yes yeah, so i'll select one of the songs that we had already added and begin to send it once you click on that the song goes it is so instant and it can be done from halfway across the globe you can use your phone this dashboard works on the phone is mobile friendly so you can still use your phone as long as you send it to the right account now there's a history tab to show all the scriptures that you've been sending you can send them again yeah so you see when i come back to the details it it, it hides those i said hide on others and here we are that's a simple screen if you want any more details on how to use this you can schedule a zoom meeting with me i'm going to put a link in the description so that you can schedule a zoom meeting and uh, learn one-on-one -on -one. i just teach you one-on-one -on -one how to use this system and you can make your contributions you can you can tell us what you want us to add or what you want us to change yeah, just to improve this product and make uh, live streaming especially for worship houses much simpler than it already is thank you very much see you again